about flu season, we have Intermountain Riverton Hospital pharmacist Melinda Gonzalez here to tell us what we need to know about this year's flu shots. Okay, first of all, why should we get flu shots so soon? So the reason we want everyone to get the flu shot early on in the season is because it takes a few weeks for immunity to build up. So the sooner someone gets it, the better. We know that season for flu peaks in December through February, but it can start as early as October and go as late as May. Okay, so will mm. it wear off if you get it now? Will it wear off before May? Absolutely not. Okay. So it's really just getting that coverage and having it the full season. Okay, mm. and uh, who should get a flu shot? So really anyone who does not want to get the flu should get a flu <laughs> shot. So it's indicated for healthy people, young people, elderly folks. The only people who really don't get the flu shot are babies who are less than six months. Okay, and they might still be protected if mom, what about pregnant women? They can get the flu shot? Yes, absolutely. So pregnant women, people with compromised immune systems, children as young as seven months, um, elderly folks up to 100, 106. <laughs> well, um, some people mm -hmm. say, well, I've never had the flu, so I'm, I'm mm -hmm. probably immune. I'll, I won't get it. Yeah, and so what we're really trying to do is prevent the spread of flu. So the more people who get the flu shot, the less likely it is to spread. So um, the flu is really contagious. It's spread by droplets in the air, so mm -hmm. people who have the flu can cough or sneeze and spread it to anyone around them. And they may even have symptoms before they know they have the flu, or they won't have symptoms before they have the flu. So it could be really easily spread. Well, when we talk about different diseases, and the mm -hmm. flu is deadly, it can be very serious. Absolutely, so the flu, can lead to pneumonia, which can lead to death. So in the 2014-2015 flu season in Utah, there were 1,400 Utah residents hospitalized from the flu. And when we look at the death rates, one in 12 listed flu or pneumonia as the reason for death. So it can be very, very serious. Okay. And this is true for children as well. Um, the flu is the number one cause of vaccine preventable death in young children. Now, did I see something about a drive up? Flu shot? Absolutely. So wow. Riverton Hospital, we are so excited this year. We are doing our first ever drive through flu clinic at our health fair on October 14th. It'll be from 9 o'clock until noon, o'clock noon, mm -hmm. and it's wonderful. You can drive up. You don't have to get out of your car. It's great for family members, lots of people. It's going to be quick. People who don't have, um, <laughs> That's a great who can't idea. move very well, don't have to get out yeah. of their car. So it'll be a great time to come in and get your flu shot. Bring Thank everyone. You. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Load up the car and get your drive up shots. Exactly. Okay, thanks so much. Some great advice. <laughs> and the weather's turning. It's feeling like flu weather, Chase. <laughs> it is. You can get a Big Mac and then.